everyone, it's Laura and welcome back to another Plan With Me video. So if you are new to my channel then I upload Plan With Me videos every Tuesday and this week I am using a kit from Mac and Grey Designs which I found on Etsy so I'm going to leave their link down in the description box and also even more shocking, well nothing I've said is shocking at the moment but something shocking is happening this week because I've used zero poppets, no poppets at all. If you don't know what poppets are then where have you been? Um, zero puppets. I can't believe that I managed to get through a whole spread without using any. And just in case none of you are aware, I am rewind planning still, so I'm trying to catch up after being on holiday. So I'm not on the wrong week. Don't panic. Don't look at the dates and think, um, what you're doing because I am rewind planning. So we're going to start off on Monday. We'll just go in day by day. So Monday I had the day off work, so I used the little um, exclamation mark to write that down. I put a full box down just to fill up the time and my daughter was having her first taster day in her new college course so I marked that down with a piece of deco and then I just whited out the black line with my tipex and then on top of there I put a quarter box and I think I was trying to find some this this was the issue I was fine with not using poppets it was then trying to find something to represent or symbolize what it was that I was writing down. I'm so used to flipping through and picking up a poppet that would go with what I'm writing down, so it did take me a little while. But on the other hand, it was really nice to use all of the small icons that comes with kits because I don't often use them, obviously because I'm using character stickers all the time. But anyway, I digress. So Monday I done some laundry. I had to film and edit my plan with me that went up on Tuesday because we were out for the day. And then moving on to Tuesday, I've put here on a half box that we went up to the city again. I went up to the city last week, I think it was on a Tuesday, and we've done some shopping. Um, I had to change my son's blazer because when we went up last week, I picked up the wrong size. And then he was going back to school on Wednesday. So Tuesday was the latest that I could go and do it. It was all like last minute. So I've put that down. And the icon that I used for that is with the credit cards. And then underneath there, I put a little birthday cake down as I wanted to get my nephew some birthday bits as it was his birthday coming up later in the week. I didn't actually get any bubble tea this time, which is a shocker, I know, because lately, every time I go to the city, I buy bubble tea, but we didn't this time. And then at the bottom there, I just marked down that we bought yet more stationery. We really probably didn't need to buy any more stationery, but I just bought school supplies. I think it was a last minute panic because they're back at school the next day. And then moving on to Wednesday, like I said, my youngest was starting back at school. So to mark that, I used another exclamation point and just wrote that down. Oh, the pen that I'm using is the Zebra Rapid Dry or Rapid Ink. I can't remember how it's worded, but it's the Rapid Dry Zebra pen that you can like wipe and it doesn't smudge and it's all magical. Um, after that, I did do a food shop and I put a full box down as food shops always seem to suck the time out of the day. You can go in at nine o'clock in the morning and before you know it, it's two o'clock and you can't believe that you've been food shopping all day. But So I put that down to mark that. And then when I got home, I did do some printing, some cutting, and I packed up some orders too. All of those orders have now been posted. Well, of course they have, because this was last week. I'm still getting into um, a kerfuffle when I'm looking at my planner thinking, hang on, I've already done that. It's because this was last week. <laughs> and then flipping over to Thursday. Thursday is when my middle child went off to college or started his college. So I put that down with another exclamation mark. And then underneath there, I'm putting down a half box. I did write out the line first, as otherwise you can see it through, especially as these are light colours. And then I used the little icon with the film clapper as I uploaded a Sims 4 video. And then I found these little arrows. I didn't even notice that they were on there. I was kind of flicking through to find something to mark that I was answering emails. And these little arrows are kind of cute. I like them. So I put that down for emails. And then my daughter went out shopping with her friends. So I put the little shopping trolley basket down for that. Now I'm just going to white out the line and put a full box down. And then right at the bottom here on a Thursday, I make sure I put my bins out ready for collection on the Friday. All very exciting stuff happening this week. And then for the actual Friday, I started off with a full box up at the top and then I did actually go to work. So I put that onto a quarter box and I used the little star icon to mark that. And it was my nephew's birthday. So I used a couple of strips of the glitter washi or glitter headers and a half box in the middle and just wrote down Camden's birthday. I feel like I need to talk, otherwise it's just going to be quiet. 
like an awkward silence. There we go, I filled it up. <laughs> and then underneath here, I'm going to be putting down a header that just says little things. And I've just got a bunch of things to put down with the little icons. So I had a Netflix binge and we actually started watching, oh, I can't remember what it's called now, Carnival Row, I think it's called. Um, and then underneath there, I've put down that my children had some homework to do. We're back to the daily grind of homework. And then flipping it to the, not flipping it at all, moving over to the weekend. I put the weekend banner down at the top and I put one of the large alarm clock deco stickers, which is perfect as we actually woke up really, really late Saturday morning. I Because we were going to be going out, I woke up 15 minutes before we had to be there. It was not, It was not a good time. I was kind of walking around going forwards and backwards in the same room because I didn't know what to do first because we were so late. But we were getting up early because we were taking the boys out for my nephew's birthday treat or I was taking my boys out with him and we were going to Airsoft. So I put a half box down which I just flipped up onto its side and then I put two pieces of washi behind it and just wrote down Airsoft and the boys had an amazing day. And then I put down a glitter header to cover up the black line. And what started off as an amazing day definitely just took a nosedive down. So my middle son was not very well, like literally violently not very well. <laughs> I've put two exclamation marks down because obviously I didn't have a shocked face poppet to put down or, you know, any poppets to rely on. And I needed everyone to know how much of a... a uh, just a situation that was so I've used two exclamation marks and what was worse is that my fiance was a 45 minute drive away and when your child any child is not well 45 minutes is a long time to wait but anyway he was much better on the Sunday which I did put down in my planner and then um I just done some housework and kind of caught up on things obviously as we were out for the day on Saturday and thank God he was fine. I think it was something that he had eaten when we were at the airsoft. I'm not sure but oh, thank goodness that was over and it wasn't like awful. Anyway, moving on. I don't know why I'm still talking about it. Um, and then on Sunday, I wanted to get all of the school stuff ready. So just put that down onto a half box and I also gave my cat a new collar. And then flipping it over to the sidebar, I used my full box up at the top. I did also use a glitter header underneath, which I don't normally do. And to be honest, I don't think there was any point because you can see like a tiny slither. So maybe pointless, maybe not. I then put down a this week header and a weekly checkbox as I wanted to start writing down my steps that I do every day because I'm not very good at taking steps. Well, when I'm at work, obviously I take lots of steps, but when I'm here doing Etsy work and YouTube work, you can see like 101 steps is not, or 188 steps is, is not very good. So I need to up my step game. So I thought if I maybe track it in my planner, it will boost me to try and walk more. Although, what's today? Today's Tuesday, it's five o'clock and I have done, let me check my app, uh, 205 steps. It's not good. Now we're moving on to my favourite part, which is, sorry if I just shouted in your ears, um, which is the deco stickers. And I just went crazy and put them all along the top because I really like doing that and haven't done it for ages. But here's everything that I've got left over, which I will be putting into a pile for my giveaway at the end of the month. Well, apart from this page, because I use all of my full boxes, but everything else will go into the pile. I hope you guys have enjoyed this week's video. If you did, then please make sure you give me a thumbs up. A comment would be awesome. And also don't forget to subscribe if you are new. I hope you guys are having an amazing day so far and I will speak to you next time. Bye bye.